Ace Banks on the track. Alright, how you guys doing? Welcome to our second video. And today I'm doing two crazy shoes. I'm doing the off-white 90s and I'm doing the Nike Adapt. So right now with my boy Zane. Yo, what's um, up? He's, he's gonna be the one recording for today. Uh, Johnny Boy can't be in the video. He's at school. Oh no, he's actually at work. I'm at school. And right now I'm going with Zane to Chick-fil-A to grab something to eat. Alright, as you can see, we made it to Chick-fil-A. Uh, so Zen, he's the owner of the Air Max 90 and I'm the owner of this. We wore the shoe for about a week each to see or to have a feel about it. And he's going to be talking about this shoe and I'm going to be talking about my shoe. Uh, so Zen, tell me, what do you think about this shoe? What's your favorite thing about this shoe and how does the shoe feel on you? Alright, I'm not going to lie. It's probably one of the hypest shoes I have personally. Um, I got lucky. I won in a giveaway with uh, Trinidad James. So shout out to you, bro. Um, honestly, they're really clean, easy to match with. But uh, I wish I didn't go true to size. I'm a size nine usually. I, I should have got a nine and a half. They run pretty tight. Yeah, that's that's a big mistake a lot of people do with the off whites. I know that. I mean, I've had a couple pair of off whites. I had the ninety sevens. I had the zoom flies. The zoom flies fit like a size eight, and I'm a nine and a half. So I had to return those and then get a size ten and a half. And I know that. I think the blazers as well run pretty small. Yeah, I have a pair of blazers. We'll do a review on that too. Yeah. They run kind of small. Yeah, I'm going to bring them in. We'll review them and then have a good time. Talk about shoes. Drive somewhere. Grab something to eat maybe again. And, you know, this is, a, this is a really cool shoe, man. I've never seen one in person. I like, you know, the off-white, how it has the Air Max, the type of Air Max. And it has the headquarters of Nike. And I like how you added the what color would you say this is i don't know it's kind of like a light pink uh like i don't know a hyper pink uh, it looks to me it looks like a salmon uh, yeah might yeah be wrong. you know guys comment tell me what color it is because i don't know my colors yes guys have yeah, but trouble. Actually, this is actually really cool i like how this matches with the with the, the, swoosh? Chest, the swoosh yeah thing. that's pretty dope um uh, something pretty cool i like and i see is the deconstructed tongue i like how you know they you know, Virgil decided to, you know, make it look like, you know. Yeah, he put a little twist on he it. He put a little twist on it. That's pretty, that's pretty dope. That's pretty bad. He also, you can see in the toe box, he also uh, has a mesh. That's pretty kind of hard to clean, so I'm trying not to get that dirty. Yeah, I've heard that. I have a couple of friends that have off-whites. The, the, I think the Jordan 1s, the, the ones, and they're pretty dirty. I see that they get stuff in there all the time, dirt, hair, and they tell me it's pretty hard to clean. Something I didn't like about the, the shoe is this so i used to have a bad habit of picking at this or walking it'll scrape yeah and, and, and it gets really annoying but other than that the shoe is pretty you know pretty cool it's pretty clean i mean you know if you got some off whites you gotta wear the tag to flex yeah, on them yeah, real you quick. Gotta flex on people know that you know you got the designer on there but other than that you know it's a pretty cool shoe all around uh this colorway is actually pretty cool as well i kind of like the black one better but Oh yeah, the black's a lot cleaner. Yes, yeah, a way, way cleaner. But you know, those retail for or resell for probably way more than these, right? Right, a little oh, bit no. more, about a hundred dollars more. Yeah, and you said you want them at a giveaway, so you didn't even have to probably pay maybe twenty, maybe. Nah, he, he showed it to me for free. Oh, no, for free? Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's 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 even. Yeah, good. Follow you got really, you got really lucky with that. Speaking of black, bro, tell me about these uh, Nike Air. Oh man, these I'm gonna say these are my favorite and most comfortable shoes I have. Uh, I've had them for about a week. Shout out to uh, Hype Experience. They're the ones that plugged me in. Um, so this shoe is actually pretty pretty comfortable, pretty easy to use. You just hook it up to your Bluetooth on your phone. You download the ADP app and you connect them. It takes maybe five minutes to connect. You know, it lets you, it lets you connect to them. You get to uh, you know tell it what's your preference and the tightness of this. So this tightens up, it loosens up when you put it on. Uh, I know that it has a cool thing right here. Just sick. Where you turn them on, you press for like two seconds, and you can change the color. I'm actually recording with the phone. I have the app on, so I won't be able to show you how to lace them and unlace them and what color to change to, but uh, it's pretty easy. So this button right here laces them. You can see how this is getting tight, and then the other one loses in it. And other what, than that, it's a pretty cool shoe. What color do you usually have it on? Oh, so say I have a red shirt, 
Oh, oh you like the match? I like yeah. the match. I like the I like to match the colors with my shirt. Um, you know, I'm I'm a little bit, you know, I'm I'm not too worried about the colors. You know, I just do something crazy. You know, if I wear a purple shirt, I'm gonna try to do pink or around the purple theme. Uh, the the bottom the bottom soles are pretty easy to clean. Like I said, I've had them for yeah, a they're week. They're pretty clean for, I wore them for a week. minute. Yeah, and I wore them for a good minute. Uh, but, you know, I like cleaning my shoes. I like keeping my shoes clean. I haven't taken the little things off. I know a lot of people are gonna be like, "Yo, what the freak? Why didn't you take them off?" You know, but I like you know I like keeping my shoes clean. Yeah, they're real clean, have, especially with plastic back here. Yeah, and I, you know I still got the insides out. The insides, I mean. You know, I had to wear, I had to put a little bit of tape in there, so when I wore it, the the sole wouldn't wear off. Uh, this is the second one, right? There was a original release. Oh yes, yes, yes. There was two releases. It was the regular one, which just, uh, it, you know, it was pretty much the same thing. But the only difference is that they have the water, the water technology, the waterproof technology, and then oh. the Z. This is the basketball. Uh, this is the basketball version of them. Uh, so this is based off of that movie, the Back to the Future. Uh, this is like a little thing from the Nike Mags. Oh yeah, it's the same technology, yeah, self-lacing. It's the same technology, the self-lacing thing. I know that uh, before the before these, there was another one. It was a Nike shoe. It was a Nike running shoe, and they um, they did that technology on them. And those were, you know, those were pretty cool shoe as well. What was the retail for these? Uh, for these, uh, it was like a crazy retail. It was like three fifty, but I got lucky and. I was able to trade in two shoes for these, uh, the Raptors, the OVO Raptors, and the Pine Greens, and he gave me, you know, these. That's a good trade. That's a really good trade. Uh, I know that my Raptors, uh, they were a little bit small. I went through the size, but I guess I have a fat foot, so they fit. They fit weird, or they were a little too small on me. So I was like, you know, why well, have a shoe that I'm not gonna wear because it doesn't fit when somebody else can enjoy it? And the Pine Greens, uh, so the Pine Greens were a little bit. Uh, they were a little bit messed up on the you know on the i had got into an accident and i kind of messed them up but the guy took him in still he was really cool about it like i said go check hurley uh not hurley souls but go check hyped experience they got really good deals i'm gonna put their uh link in the description and i can go check them out all right so we're going back to the campus now we, leave, we left chick-fil-a now uh so i want to give a thanks to zan for being in my video i want to apologize for y'all for making this video so long I know now the video is about maybe over 10 minutes, but you know, if you really enjoy this, you know, keep watching us, uh, like and subscribe, uh, and see you next time. We're going back to the campus now. We, leave, we left Chick fil A now. Uh, so I want to give a thanks to Zan for being in my video. I want to apologize for y'all for making this video so long. I know now the video is about maybe over 10 minutes, but you know, if you really enjoy this, you know, keep watching us, uh, like and subscribe. Uh, and see you next time. Sexy video time.